did its uh, new client sales goals by 45%. Sorry, I was ragging on you. So nice job, Scott. Congratulations for winning the COO of the Year Award. to Miles and Pete as well. Um, it, I just want to say thanks to a couple of, of uh, members of our team, Sarah Silva and Julie Price, and then our CEO, Brooke Mahoney, who could not be with us today, uh, for nominating me for this. It's a lot of work to, to go through that process. Um, I'm blessed to have my wife and my <coughs> adult sons over there, Taylor and Jordan and Debbie. Uh, Deb's got a successful career in her own right. Jordan's an Eagle Scout, and Taylor graduates from uh, UCD with a master's in healthcare administration. If anybody's interested in uh, <laughs> uh, You know, I, I think that our competitive advantages, advantage at CCIG is our culture, and we're very proud of it. And we've got 65 plus employees that work well together that uh, really like each other. Uh, they're very ambitious, they're very innovative. We problem solve together, and it's just a flat, a flat organization chart. We don't have a lot of hierarchy, and so if a fire breaks out in the corner, there's a lot of people, uh, regardless of name, rank, and serial number, trying to solve it. Um, you know, I grew up in a strong Christ-centered family uh, back in Virginia, and, uh, and I just think a lot of the things in terms of wellness, community supporter just in my DNA uh, because of that. And I think everybody at the table uh, with, with us tonight is, feels the exact same way. So uh, thanks again. I'll leave you with a, uh, with a quote that struck me last night. Uh, we must be the change we wish, we wish to see in the world. Mahatma Gandhi, I'm sure everybody's heard that before. If not, write it down. Thanks again. Thank you. So